Well, the mayor says it took a grassroots effort of friends calling friends to let them know about the clinic, as well as a lot of volunteers to make it all happen. What we've done is created another channel of distribution for the vaccine here in the River Valley. She said, I need 100, Ida. I said, okay, we're going to get it. Ida Spears helped out by calling her friends to let them know about today's vaccination clinic. So I didn't have no problem getting nobody to take it. I didn't, nobody turned me down. Let them hear trusted voices when it comes to the, the effectiveness of the, of the vaccine and they begin to respond in a very positive way. Underrepresented populations, if you're finding uh, an angst, I would say sign up, come get vaccinated, save your lives and the lives of others. Dr. Harvey Potts with the College of Osteopathic Medicine says it's important to help get vaccines to those who need it most, especially in minority and impoverished neighborhoods. So now that we know access is an issue, how do we collectively solve the problem? Solving the problems takes events like this where multiple players come to the table. Well, it has been difficult because we first got to get aware of it, that it's for our health and safety. And with everything going on, we have to get it. So it has to be very prevalent that we do it. City buses helped shuttle people to the clinic. Medical and nursing students with local colleges helped people get checked in and administered approximately 500 shots. I want them to see, you know, community service. I want them to see serving others. I want them to see what nursing is about as far as, you know, caring for everybody, no matter where they come from or who they are. I would love to see everyone get out there and get vaccinated. I already had COVID and I have the antibodies, but I wanna do whatever I can to prevent the spread. And they'll administer the second round of vaccinations three weeks from now on March 17th. Now the mayor says he hopes the city can help coordinate more mass vaccination clinics like today here in the future sometime soon. Live in Fort Smith, Brett Rains, 4029 News.